first. All right, y'all, welcome back to the first shed. Yeah, we're in the first shed tonight skinning. Um, I'm actually I'm just kind of in the middle of skinning today's catch here. Uh, so I've been kind of cherry picking what I've been keeping, obviously with the markets. Uh, I've also kind of been doing more selective trapping this year. But anyway, this is today's catch here. Um, I got uh, half a dozen uh, nice big prime coons. Uh, got nice coyote. I actually just skinned him out. Uh, uh, and all my coyotes this year, I'm actually leaving the feet on, all four feet on. So if you guys would be interested in a video on that, how I'm doing up the coyotes for, for tanning in this market, uh, leave a comment down below. Also got a really nice double white striped skunk there and uh, a big, nice white possum. Yes, I actually do have a market for possums this year. So anyway, like I said, not a huge haul, but this is kind of what I've been doing this year. So just a good run of the mill, uh, just catch today. Anyway, I thought I'd stop real quick and let you guys know, uh, due to a lot of interest uh, again this year, we are bringing back the, the Coon Creek Fur Handling Package. Um, so last year, I, I partnered up with Charlie over at Hoosier Trapper Supply, uh, and we brought you all a, a good quality fur handling package. And then Charlie was kind enough to, to throw in a, a discount, you know, with, with fur prices and gas prices and everything else, it's great to save money. So we're bringing that back again this year, uh, had a lot of interest again. So we're bringing back the, the Coon Creek Fur Handling Package. I wanted to share with you guys what's in the package. This is all stuff that I picked out. And this is all stuff that I use. This is not just some random, you know, Ah, here we go. No, so this is all stuff that either I have used in the past or am currently using in my my own fur shed. So anyway, I'll I'll share with you what we've got in the trapping package. So like I said, Charlie is going to be kind enough to give you all a discount. So whenever you click the link down below, you know you're getting a discounted price compared to if you were you know basically to buy all this stuff uh, separate. But anyway, I'll jump right into it here. So first things first. You need a good apron. Uh, so I've got a, a good apron, this, you know, for skinning and flushing, for everything. So I've got a, a good heavy duty PVC apron. I, I've used this one in the past, been very happy with it. Um, we've got a good apron. Also got a, a good uh, skinning gambrel here. This is very similar to my homemade speed skinning gambrel you guys have seen me use. All right, so you guys can see here, I've got what? four different species on the table today that I, I'm gonna skin. And this fur handling package will take care of, of everything. Not just these four species, but everything. So, you know, pretty universal deal. So we've got a good uh, skinning gambrel here. Take care of all your critters. We've got a heavy duty fur brush. Um, it, it, a fur brush will make or break your fleshing, y'all. Uh, the ability to be able to get out burrs, mats, uh, you know, just everything like that, clean that fur up before you flesh it will, um, will make or break your fleshing. Trust me. So you got nice heavy duty fur brush included. Uh, as far as, as skinning knives, these are two knives that I use, um, in my first shed. So we've got the triangle knife here. This is the triangle knife. Uh, y'all have seen me use for years. I call it my first cut knife and it's, it's that knife that I, make that money cut or the first cut on every critter. Uh, just a super, super nice knife to be able to get underneath that skin and cut up rather than down into the meat. This is also the knife that I use whenever I skin out the feet of, of critters and do around the ears. Just a super precise knife. Uh, so threw that in there. And then we've got a good, nice, um, skinning knife, something that, that'll sharpen up easy. You guys have always heard me talk. I, I'm concerned more about the handle, the, a nice handle that you can get your hand around and grip more than anything. So we've got a nice, nice skinning knife in there too. Um, I, I'm big on, on tail strippers. I think it'll, it'll save you a lot of time and a lot of aggravation. So we threw in a nice heavy duty uh, aluminum Tail stripper here. This one's got uh, two different size holes for, for different size critters. This thing will last you a lifetime if you take care of it. And then we have a tail zip for zipping the tails if you're not comfortable using a knife. So just a, a super nice tool. I've, I've used these a, a lot in the past as well. Uh, finally, we have a fleshing knife. 
So this is a Necker 600 fleshing knife. Uh, this is the knife that I used exclusively for several years. Um, Y'all can go back. I've got older videos of fleshing a coon and, you know, a minute, minute 30 with this knife. Uh, just a very nice quality knife, but very user friendly. Comes with a sharp side and a dull side, so it's, it's ready to go out of the box. Uh, nice, nice big handles on it that your hands won't run into the blade. Nice stops there. So anyway, Necker 600 knife we're throwing in there. Like I said, all these products I have used in the past or am currently using in my first shed. So a lot of interest again this year. So like I said, you can check the link down uh, in the description if you wanna go, it'll take you to Hoosier Trapper, uh, take you to that fur handling package. There's no discount code needed, no promo code, nothing. We've just went ahead this year and just added in the discount to it. So made it super, super easy, super user friendly. And then, you know, while you're there at Hoosier, you may as well check out some of this awesome apparel that we've got this year. I'll show you guys quick. We've got the, the Coon Creek logo there on the front, and then we've also got it on the back. So this hoodie's dirty. I've been wearing it now uh, for a good majority of the season, but yeah, I've been holding up really, really well. Um, real high quality stuff here we, we got going this is not your chinese teespring junk stuff so very proud of that uh, but yeah coon creek fur handling package um a lot of interest in it last year and um uh, you know we ran it through a certain date last year uh and this year we're bringing it back so get on it while you can um use the link down below so super excited uh, to bring that back for you guys again last year. I had a lot of positive feedback on that. So anyway, gonna get back to skin in here. You can see, like I said, I am kind of cherry picking what I'm keeping this year, but you can see, I mean, you know, like, oh, look at this. Like this, the averages are great. I mean, this is, <laughs> This is, a, this is a really nice 3X boar coon. Uh, they are looking great this year. Um, super nice primed up coon. That's what I'm keeping. That's what I've got to market for. So anyway, y'all, I'm going to get back to skinning. I uh, just wanted to come on and tell y'all super excited for the, uh, the fur handling package again this year. Check it out. It'll be the link down below. I'll also put a, uh, a link to it in the comment section. It'll be pinned at the top. So be easy for you to find. Like I said, while you're there, check out some apparel. Pretty nice stuff. So anyway, y'all, I'm gonna get back to skinning. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you all are having a very successful season out there. As always, I appreciate the view. We'll see you on the next one.